Hey guys, so today Apple released a new update for the Apple Watch. I wanted to talk about the details in regards to the latest Apple Watch update 9.6.1. In this video, I also want to talk about when we can expect the next beta for iOS 17. I know you guys are all anticipating the next beta here shortly. I want to talk about the expected release date and if we'll see any additional official software release for the iPhone, the iPads, and the Apple Watch before iOS 17. Some minor updates to AirDrop, just a few things that I wanted to cover in today's video. So let's go ahead and dive right into this one now as i mentioned today apple released a new software update for the apple watch watch os 9.6.1 and now this is of course an official software update rolling out to everyone that's not running the beta obviously so watch os 9.6.1 this update includes a bug fix that will prevent access to motion data for apps that use the movement api this is to track of course any symptoms from the parkinson disease or any tremors and things like that so if you were having issues and you use any third-party application that does require access to these sensors, watchOS 9.6.1 will now address this issue. Of course, this is an update important here for Apple in order to get access to that data on your Apple Watch. WatchOS 9.6.1 is now available. Now, interestingly enough, Apple did not update the iPhone or the iPad. I was expecting to see iOS 16.6.1 maybe coming out to the iPhone. That did not happen. iPad OS 16.6.1 that did not happen so apple only updated the apple watch today now i want to talk about ios 17 and some minor changes that i want to talk about here in regards to airdrop and privacy apple has updated the terms and of course we got some new updates with ios 17 especially in beta 5 apple has now updated the terms as we now have the capabilities of sending airdrop files over the cell network right so before you can only send airdrop files when someone was next to you well now you can send these files things like photos videos websites location and other things using your iPhone to another iPhone without having to be next to the iPhone for the entire process right you can walk away and this will happen over the air over the internet and Apple just updates the terms that this information will be filtered through Apple servers as is being sent over the air over your carriers network and now the new services will be implemented into the future in iOS 17 of course this is a great feature because no longer will you have to be sitting next to each other in order to airdrop a file if you want to send a large file like a video that's about five minutes you can send it over walk away and it will continue sending over the air and that's what these basically airdrop privacy updates are in regards now in terms of the next beta i know a lot of you guys are asking what happened with ios 17 developer beta 6 public beta 4 is an apple going to be releasing every week well to be honest i was thinking that today was going to be the day that we see the next beta but it looks like apple had other plans more important the apple watch issue to address if apple does release another beta later today of course i'll update you guys with that information but it looks like ios 17 developer beta 6 and public beta 4 will most likely be happening most likely tomorrow on the 16th of august now apple of course can change this at any time no one really knows when they will be releasing any betas or any software updates but if history is any indication last year on august the 15th they did release another beta for ios 16 so based on that last year's schedule i was hoping to see another beta this year with ios 17 but that was not the case again we can expect another beta for ios 17 tomorrow on august the 16th and the public beta a day or two after that as well i just wanted to give you guys a quick update on some of the information in regards to apple watch and some of the fixes happening here and of course let you guys know everything that's happening right now thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoy the quick video and i'll see you guys on the next one peace